Hello and welcome back to Idle Kingdom Defense. So today we stayed at 90, 9130. I don't know when I'm going to push. Um, I think I'm going to stay here for a little while and try to build up. I really can't see myself pushing beyond 9270 for a while. So the goal is to go up another 150 levels, but as you saw yesterday, we struggled immensely with King's Ruins and in fact... I just used a bunch of ruin skips for, for one reason, because we died on the second stage. So I was like, well, that's an eye-opener, and then I just kind of wanted to kind of shuffle us through. But without further ado, let's get looking at the expedition. So we'll try a little bit harder today for King's Ruins. We'll see what happens. I kind of feel we're getting very close to our limit. Oh, we got the Ascension Stones. But we didn't get the hero seal, so that's a shame. Okay, we need Gabriel. We aren't getting him any other way. And we'll also chase those hero seals. Apparently we're not getting Gabriel nor the hero seals because the game just likes to mess with us. Let's try... Okay, there's nothing here. We're just going to open a chest. Whatever we get. Okay, goodbye. Thanks for nothing. Oh, Sophia, we do need her. Yeah, that's another thing, too. We really need to see, like, from a damage... Don't get... So, we get the... At least we get the hero seals. How about that? That's a, that's another uh, thing to point out, is... The only way our damage is going up at this point is 5-star Legendary Gabriel. Okay, got those. I'll open one more. It's gonna be Diego, isn't it? Yeah. Shouldn't open one more. Um, the only way our damage is gonna go up is if we get to 5-star Legendary Gabriel, because it gives us two more seconds. And we're gonna chase those Ascension Stones, by the way. And the other, or not, we're just not going to get the Ascension Stones. And the other way is we're going to get Sophia to 5 star Legendary, because it'll make her heal last longer. Yes, leveling Sophia and really ruining Sophia. Damn, don't get the stones. Ruining Sophia has really been the best thing that we could do. But we haven't had a ton of luck with that. We'll see if we can get some luck today. And we are chasing those Hero Seals. So really, without Mythic Archer Gear, we're kind of in an extreme holding pattern. Which is why I don't know that we'll be able to get past 9270 anytime soon. Of course, ooh, we got the Ascension Stones. Of course we will try. I'm not I'm not against trying. Uh, it just means that we're going to wait until we have more Hero Gear upgrades. So we're going for the Stones. <sighs> so that's, that's kind of where I feel like we're at right now. And I, I've, there's somebody else in the Discord... And I listen to him a lot, and he's he's been playing longer than me. His castle is probably at least 7,000 levels higher than mine. And I was, I was, okay, got the stones. We'll open one more. Okay, Austin, we don't really need you, but okay. And uh, I said, you know what, sure. He, he was saying the same thing I was, that, that you either have to, oh, damn it, don't get the stones again. You either have to babysit the game, or you just don't get it. All right, going after the Ascension Stones. You just don't get to advance. And to me, babysitting the game... That was pretty nice. We got the scrolls, too. We, To me, babysitting the game... Okay, we're going after the Ascension Stones. It's just not something I want to do when pushing. As you saw in King's Ruins... Like, oh, geez, that was... This was a disastrous day. We did not get much luck at all for our expeditions. That was awful. It's just not my style to want to manually push all the time. It's okay, but I mean, I like my King's Ruins, where, you know, I just come in there and I, you know, I show who's boss. And I definitely, yesterday, jeez, yesterday I did not show who was boss. It showed me who was boss. We'll try again today. Today is a new day, and we need to remember that. Now, granted, the other five levels I did were fine. It was just this, the trebuchet level, or sorry, the ballista level that gave me a lot of problems. And once again, we're not really getting anything great here. Nothing really to write home about. Are picking up a few rune seals, which um, I actually have a specific thing I need to use those for. Okay. Some gear summons. Eh, nothing really great. Um, oh, I forgot where I was at. I am looking for... Nope, nope, nope. Yes, this one. If you're wondering why I'm summoning this, we are specifically looking for these for Sophia. The reason being is I was looking at Sophia and I realized that that one extra attack power was not maxed. You know, I, I, 
I did mention something with Sophia, and now I realize I need to check it, but we will, we will check it momentarily, because we're about to, we're going to do some more summons. Yes, that's, yep, that's all we're left with. Ooh, we'll save those for tomorrow. I like saving these because it just lets me get the daily quests out of the way earlier. All right, so we'll do these quick summons. And nothing really exciting. Really looking for chest pieces and weapons. How high does this... Okay, that goes up to legendary one. Of course, I don't get anything. All right, I know, I know I'm kind of scattered, right? I was doing that, and I'm like, oh, you know, let's go by. We're, we'll go back to gear. I was more curious about, can we get anything out of here? Gear summoning hasn't been that exciting, honestly. It seems like the gear we summon, it's like, oh, here's a pair of shoes. It's like, oh, damn it, I missed Roderick. I was, ugh. It was just, it was just one Roderick. It's no big deal. But yeah, the gear we summon, it's like, yeah, go fish. Not really what I'm looking for most of the time. So, <clears throat> yeah, it's unfortunate. Man, that was a whole bunch of nothing. All right, let's see if we can get a two-star weapon. Okay, we got a one-star helmet. We don't need those. Yeah, we are on two-star gear. Whoops, we don't want to use rubies. All right, well, let's summon here. We got 10,000, so we really did not do a good job with anything today. And that's three misses in a row. Four misses in a row. Five misses in a row. And finally, we break it with Daniel. Hello, Daniel. Welcome. Welcome your shards. Okay, one. And we break it with Lucas and Julian. Okay. <clears throat> and one. And two. And three. And... Okay, we break it on four with Anthony, which we don't need because he's already... I mean, we need him. But I'm really looking for... Oh, hello, Lucas. Nice to see you. I'm really looking for, um, Sophia. Hi, Harold. Uh, nice to see you. Adrian. Okay, we can actually use Adrian. I think she's only four-star legendary. Yeah, the, the part that I that made me not believe that this happened, and hello, Roderick. Nice to see you. Is that I actually got... Ooh, Marion. Nice to see Marion and Roderick again. I got to replace uh, Xavier with, um... Adrian. That, to me, I thought was going to be the tipping point. And some Camila. We haven't seen much Camila. And we even got a hundred bonus from the devs for that, you know, celebration thing. And more Herald. I mean, you'll be your extra Herald will be useful one day, just not today. <clears throat> and more Camila. Okay, maybe she'll get up to two-star legendary. And, ooh, some Marion. But I'm really looking for Sophia. Sophie is like, I think, two summons away. And Julian. And Roderick. And, okay, Gabriel won't complain. Even though I don't think Gabriel's going to help, I would still like to get it and confirm it doesn't help. Come on. Give me some Sophia. Sophia, Sophia. Sophia. Ooh, there we go. You just have to sing it. See, there's Sophia. And I'm sorry, I don't sing very well, so Sophia. Oh, well, more Marion. Sophia. No more Marion and Anthony. Sophia? No. And that's it. Yep, sorry you had to hear me sing. I was trying to sing for Sophia. We might have gotten enough to upgrade Sophia, which might actually... Sophia herself won't change anything at this level, but, she, you know, we still need... We still need to get her up, right? All right. Oh, we get both of them. We got both. Okay, this is a double. So we get to send Sophia to four star. Very nicely done, Sophia. And we actually have ascended you before I hit the cap, so that's kind of impressive. And we send, uh, we will send Gabriel, and we don't, I don't know that I don't think that's going to help. But you know what? At the end of the day, we have it now. Okay. Well, we know where this is going, and we get to eighty-three hundred. Congratulations, Sophia. And Marion, you will be ascended.
Hmm. Yeah, so one of the things I've been considering doing is promoting all of the lower level heroes to at least one star uh, rare. Just because I use them on the castles, and these are really cheap levels to get. So, I mean, we might as well, like, make rare. Uh, how much How much is... I mean, this is, like, trivial amounts of uh, stones. At least to get them to rare. That does mean I'm going to have to compromise a little bit. Maybe maybe this will be the thing. Oh, I can't. I can't. This can't be the thing that I that I regret. All right, let's see. How much is it to make you rare? 1440. All right, I can live with that. The thing is, though. Okay, wait. I do need to change. Roderick. <clears throat> and if you're wondering why this is happening. This is so just when I go to swap them in, they're one star ahead, so they are still stay ahead of everybody else. It's not really going to help me with using them to level or anything like that. Though it is interesting to see Raven has dodge. Dodge is actually very important for your warriors. Because the real reason is I wanted to promote Blake, and he's like 1300 or something like that. So if I promoted Blake, Blake to the same star rating as these... Basically, Blake would then jump ahead of them, and I'd have to go find the rest of them. I didn't want to deal with that. All right, so let's get everybody to wear. And again, I'm doing this just for extra conquest. I, I really don't expect this to be a huge thing, but at the same time, we're clearly not getting the patch. Whatever tiny amount I spend on these guys will eventually pay for itself. And my goal is to eventually get everybody to legendary anyways. Plus, I mean, it's kind of neat to have more warriors. I mean, not, you know, more heroes ascended, you know. This is like a side goal. This is, this is my conquest side goal. Okay, don't judge me. Actually, you can judge me. Judge me in the comments and say how stupid this was. But I'll live with it. Interesting, he has defense penetration. That's unfortunately very useless. What I was curious about... Oh, accuracy. Yeah. Honestly, one of the things I've learned is the best... Like, defense penetration is great up until you get higher with the gear, right? Like, like as a starting stat, that's probably amazing. Makes him do a ton of extra damage. The higher you get, the less and less valuable it becomes until it's worthless. I would say the best secondary stat is crit damage. If if he was crit damage, that would have been amazing. But that's probably why like I don't think any of them are crit damage. Ah, Carlos. Oh, at least I used you to 500. That's interesting to see. Did not expect that. So again, this is just... Uh, yeah, we're, re we're really kind of running out of things to do. Actually, I think I saw a comment from somebody that was like... Why don't you just promote people for extra stuff from the conquest? And I was like, you know, this really, like, I'm never going to, like, the amount of ascensions, like, how long they're going to have to sit on the castle for ascension stones to get these back, it's never going to make sense from that perspective. But the way it makes sense to me is not from them return, you know, extra ROI from them for, um, you know, sitting on the castle. That's not what I'm looking for when I do these ascensions. What I'm specifically looking for is extra gold. I feel like the extra gold per day might be useful. Somebody will go do the math and say, you were wrong, uh, Zerden. None of the extra gold is useful, and you should be ashamed of yourselves. I'm sure somebody will say that in the comments. And I just noticed Marcus has crit damage. It's probably why he's so strong earlier and why he eventually trails off. Because crit damage is an amazing stat. Accuracy... 
Accuracy is one of those stats where either you have enough accuracy and any additional accuracy sucks, or you don't have enough accuracy and it just sucks, period. So. Okay, so... And I, I do get a lot of questions, why do heroes have health that are on the support castle? It doesn't do anything for the castle. It doesn't matter at all. The only hero it matters for is Sophia. But the reality is, when they were making these heroes, they made a template that worked both for warriors and worked for support heroes. And there was no reason not to have it carry over. You know, what if they wanted to do something different with support heroes one day? Well, they already have hit points and everything set up if, you know, support heroes battled each other or something. That actually would be kind of interesting as a mechanic. But I don't know how it would work, you know? I mean, again, like, like reasonably, like when I push, right? My warriors and their gear is enough to keep them healthy, you know? If my warriors die, it's because you saw we're doing an extremely long fight that's like 20 minutes long. And there's no way for them to heal, so that's why they die. But, you know, so again, I wouldn't expect the support heroes to have any issue staying alive. Oh, we have one. Miguel. Well, Miguel also has a knockup, huh? I didn't know that. Crit damage reduce. Eh, that's no good. You want dodge. If you, if you want a defensive ability on your warrior, it's dodge. Dodge is super OP. But, yeah, so somebody I'm sure will in the comments will be like, yeah, this will pay for itself in like 10 years. And I'll be like, well, at least I had the Ascension Stones to afford it, you know. Wow, I think this actually has taken more Ascension Stones than I thought. Um, whoops, well, that's fine. We know we're not getting it, so what's the big deal? I think this has taken 40, 50,000 Ascension Stones to get this high. Well, wait, 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 wait. That's also with promoting both her, which was like 11,000, and him, which was uh, like 9,000. Actually, wait, what is he? No, I don't even know. It was probably like 10,000. So 21,000 was, so we spent like 20K. That's fine. That's fine. We'll deal with that. That's the reason I haven't promoted Lucas, though, too. Because Lucas is, my, I, I just don't use him. Well, that plus this level doesn't do anything. And same thing with, uh, I really was gonna max um, it, it, the healer chick here, but yeah, that was that. That's gone. Oh, I forgot we we can promote Camila. Okay, we're gonna do that. Yeah, defense penetration. Nice idea. Not very useful in the long term. I didn't even see her. So now we have all rare heroes. So, how about that? And how much did it cost us? It cost us everything. It cost us, no, it really only cost us about 20,000 Ascension Stones, which, yeah, I'll make that in a day and a half. Again, like I said, like we saw, it's not like it's changing anything soon. We can breathe easy at spending our Ascension Stones. I, so my plan is actually, if I get my Ascension Stones to 1.4 million, anything over 1.4 million, I will just spend willy-nilly. I cannot imagine, see, everybody's blue now. That's very nice to see. Oh, you know, it doesn't even show up well because, yeah, it cuts over like that. That's okay. Yep, all right, everybody's a minimum of rare. And we still don't have somebody for this castle, so we need to get a new recruit. How much is it? Let's look at Logan. How much extra is Logan now? One point forty four. So that's weird. Logan's ahead of or well, whatever. Why is Logan ahead of Carlos in the pecking order? We'll never know. So it's a one it's a 144 144% bonus so 
that is almost like halfway. So I think rare two would probably be about halfway. We have any? Well, we'll look at rare three. Okay, rare three, yeah. Is so rare three would actually get you half of the bonus with, you know, hardly. You know what? Uh, no. Yes. Maybe. How much is that? Two thousand. How many rare heroes do I have? One, two, three, four, five, six. Wait. One, two. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Oh, well, that's a lot. Yeah, I was, I was gonna say, well, let's get everybody up to, you know, rare three star. That'll be easy. And these, guys will, yeah, that's too expensive. Too expensive. Nice idea though. But everybody's rare. I would say spending the however much. I think it was only like 20k to get everybody up here. It's hard to say because I wasn't paying attention when I promoted these. I could have been, could have been a little bit more. But again, we'll get to our 1.4 million, and we'll just spend more freely. So that said, Sophia is very far away. Adrian is almost halfway. And Gabriel, I just, I wish I could get shards for Gabriel. And after that, it's it's Camila, and I promote Camila because um, she's on B team. She does big dame. All right. So we'll see. Uh, again probably not worth it but i mean it, again it was 20k stones and we know we're not getting we know the next update is not mythic heroes so who cares well who cares is not what i should say but anyways once again thank you for watching please like and subscribe to support the channel and if you have any questions please say something in the comments i always do enjoy your questions and thank you again i hope you have a great day